Oh, I'll just give a quick look at those two new cars driving on the track. One of them came with the out of the box tyres on it, which meant it had gross understeer and massive tail sliding wheel spinning characteristics on my track, but I've swapped it over to Kyosho aftermarket tyres, so now it's sticky, um, handles really well. So I'll get on to that. Okay, so I'm driving in the current F1 that came as a McLaren F1 in the ready set. The one that had those interesting tyres and straight grooves. And I've um, trimmed it a bit and the settings on the radio. That's good, turning a little bit to the right. It's the one that in the tight corner I'm coming into now where it tends to oversteer by slipping at the rear. So I'll just tweak the trim a little bit more. with it is that tight corner where it tends to oversteer and it loses grip at the rear. So I think I'll change the tyres on it. Other than that, it's going well. And this is a McLaren F1 that came as a Lexus SC430 that has the oil shock and different springs on the front. So it came with bog standard ready set tyres. So I've swapped it over to aftermarket Kyosho ones which gives it much better grip and traction. Right, I've got to get used to it. Right, I can tell I need to make some changes.
Yeah, it's not bad. Still wish it would turn just a little bit sharper. And my cashier radio is warning me it's about to run out of power, so I'll end it there. Thanks for watching, guys.